Yo, 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 what's going on, everybody? This your boy Quan once again, here to talk about those footballers in our Yahoo Fantasy Football League. I hope you all will forgive me. I took a bye week last week, but I'm back. I know it's a Monday night, it's a little late. You know, things are a little hectic, you know what I'm saying? But I'm trying to still come through and come true for everybody in the league. You know what I'm saying? So, without any further ado, let me get into what happened last week, week nine in our league, okay? Now, <clears throat> my team, Too Hot for TV, comes through in fine fashion. Um, it was probably going to be an easy game. Don't want to talk too much about it, but I got the W over last year's champion. Chat, please. 142.5. To 70, no, to 99 points. Sorry about that. I don't want to slight you at all. Okay, we had Gamecocks number one come through with a victory over GA Boy 72, 182.50 to 165.50. So, we're talking less than 20 points, but nevertheless, good victory against the team who was on a you know what I'm saying? A nice streak there at one point. I think went 7-0. and oh. You know, so now we're starting to see, you know, a little dose of reality. You know what I'm saying? That, you know, he actually can bleed a little bit. Okay? But I think he's going to make a strong... He may, Well, not going to think, but he makes a strong recovery this week against Too Hot for TV. Moving on. <laughs> that there... What you know about that there? You know, I know that there won in week 9, 161.50 over Pink Cats, who scored 145 points. Rather be golfing comes through with a victory, the big dub over Mikey B. Jams, 173.50 to Mikey B. Jams, 120.50. And with the highest amount of points by two teams in the league this week. Unfortunately, they had to go against each other. We've got Gang Green scoring an awesome 248.50 points versus Hard Knocks, who scored 186 points. And even though Gang Green stomped on them by, you know what I'm saying, a little bit more than 60 points? Yeah, a little more than 60 points. If Hard Knocks had fought and went against anybody else in the league, they would have won. No problem. Okay, now, let's get into the standings right now because we have a new team in the number one spot. You know what I'm saying? With a record of 8-1, and one, they've been on a six-game winning streak. And just this week, they clinched a playoff spot. Gang Green! <sighs> Gang Green! Ah, comes through. So, by him being in first place, GA Boy 72 falls to second place with a record of 7 and 2. They've been on a two game losing streak, but like I said, they're about to bounce back about that. So, he'll be alright. Too Hot for TV is in third place, baby. Holding it strong, you know what I'm saying? You know, we've been on a five game winning streak. So, with a record of seven, well, six and three, I should say, not seven and two. Maybe we'll go for seven another time. <clears throat> in fourth place, we have Gang Cox, number one, with a record of five and four. Okay, they've been on a two game winning streak. So they've been doing their thing, trying to move on up in the rankings, you know what I mean? In fifth place, with a record of 5-4 and four as well, we've got Hard Knocks. Now, Hard Knocks kind of fell a little bit over the past couple weeks, not including this week. You know, they've been on a little losing streak. So, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully they can go ahead and bounce back and try to get a little playoff spot. Now... In sixth place, with a record of three and six, we've got Rather Be Golfing, and in seventh place, we've got Pink Cats, also with a record of three and six. The next two teams also have a record of three and six, and they are that there in eighth place and Mikey B Jams in ninth place. And in tenth place, with a record of two and seven, Chuck, please. I like saying the name, you know. I, 
I know you down at the bottom, but good thing you got a cool name. You know what I'm saying? So, but anyway, like I said, it's almost playoff time. Like I said, Gang Ring has already secured a spot. Now, let's see who else gets up in there. You know what I'm saying? We all going for that goal, baby. Good luck to everybody. And I know the games are just about over as far as this week, week 10 in fantasy football. So, I wish you all well. And I'll check you next time. Peace.